Right, right here we got the guys, the two guys, the two, the only guys from Bada Bing. Yes, I'm sorry. Uh oh, the strip tease has begun. Strip tease. I don't, I'm not wearing a belt, so I can't use one. Just don't do it. Jenna. So how's it going? You guys just got done playing at the hideout here in yes, San Diego. Yes, yes. How how that go? How did it feel coming off the stage? How that feel? Felt good. The, yes. the the walls were solid. I could throw myself against it, and that's uh, if I if I don't make any holes in them, that, that works also. The wood backing is nice. It is very nice. It feels classier than we are. Yes, but you can tell there's cement behind it. So I don't know what right. that means? You so you, mean you, you could feel the cement behind the wood? Yes, as I bang my head against the wall, I can feel yeah. the cement. Back there. So it wasn't like the Ken Club where you accidentally broke a hole into the wall. Hearsay, but yes, it's nothing like that. Yeah, that never that never happened. Never happened. So you guys just released a new EP. <coughs> we did, yeah. A physical piece of music. A yes. CD. I mean, technically. Yeah. It's you what the hell were you guys thinking? <laughs> we, were, we were thinking everybody else is doing it, so why shouldn't we do it? Oh, okay. Um, Same reason we're on Facebook or we just, SoundCloud. Or we try to... Page, any of that. We're trying to produce things to put onto iTunes and uh, uh, Spotify. And my, and, my, my spot. And my spot. Yeah. And, uh, you know, there are a bunch of geo sites we still haven't been able to submit anything into. <laughs> that is a huge cockroach. <laughs> I want to catch it. Catch it. It's gone. He escaped. All right, well, so much for that. So you guys had, you guys have been sitting on a lot of these songs pretty much for a pretty long time. I mean, the whole recording process took forever. I mean, just because yeah. of life and Weirdly other bands. Enough, the actual recording took two days. Well, <laughs> it's just getting... The whole process, yes, it, will, it took almost two years. Well, that's, we're really fortunate. We have a lot of really good friends that gave us great deals on it. And so we, God, we paid next to nothing for it. So let's get let's get down to the serious business. Uh, like, what's your favorite types of porn that you guys like to watch? Favorite what, types of porn. Favorite types of porn. Um, what do you guys like to watch? Man, well, anything where there are, uh, I really like the big, smooth. Meat. And you mix the two, and it looks like they're enjoying it. That's what I like. I like that. Oh, wait. Passion. Oh, passion. Excuse me. Uh, they're done. Oh. Fancy that. Oh, look, look at that. Yeah. Look. Whoa, hey. Oh, hey. This is what we've been cooking up. That's the that's the new Bada Bing t-shirt, and that's the new Bada Bing, wait, let me get that in focus, Bada Bing CD. What's it, what's it, what's that called? It's I, called uh, Don't Feed the Animals. Don't Feed the Animals. Okay. Don't Feed the Animals. All right. How much is that... Uh, where, where can they uh, pick that up at? Like uh, Best Buy, uh, Walmart? Where, where can they buy that well, at? We're actually trying to go off of the uh, current Wu Tang Clan method of selling CDs. So this one's going for about two million. Oh. Um, I know that Wu Tang Clan still hasn't sold their single CD for five million, so we're bringing it down three. Oh. Uh, so um, I mean, it's all a business plan. Another thing they did wrong too is that they only made one. We made fifty. So we're about Oof, maybe think about fifteen million in. Yeah, uh, we're the we're the Walter Whites of San Diego music. Nice. Uh, we don't really well until now. We don't really talk about it, uh, but we're, we're we're balls deep in money. Oh. We're, we're like a Scrooge McDuck, <laughs> swimming in it. We never get bored. We just cash them all in for the dollar coins. Oh. We lay them out in a kiddie pool and we masturbate in it. Yeah. Nice. And then we donate that money. What about? Dead? Perfect. 70 yeah. years? Yeah, 70, 70 years. years. No, 70. <laughs> I'm a fighter, so I don't know. It's true. Well, on the it's subject the of being dead, longer. how do you see yourself dying, Ryan? I mean, what, what, what do you think the scenario is going to be? Oh, good question. Probably I'm... choking on semen. Autoerotic asphyxiation. <laughs> ah. What about you, Tom? How do you envision your death? Will it be violent? It'll... Or will you be masturbating in the shower and your heart's going to stop and you're going to collapse and then when the police come, they're going to look at all of the external hard drives that you have hidden in your closet and they're going to find all oh, of those God. pictures, all those porn pictures that you Photoshop Ryan's face on and, and your face is on the other guy and you're having sex with Ryan. Now, how is Ryan going to feel when he sees all these pictures Photoshopped of you having sex with him? Well, I would like to think that my death, since he will obviously be dead before I am, uh, is that I will have a donator's cup full. 
all thawed out in the microwave. A cup, that's it. A pitcher, and I will microwave it, and I will have the belt ready in the closet, all the David Carradine, and then I'll take all of those pictures that I have pasted Ryan's face on, and I will. Oh, I have eventually succumbed to suffocating on. Succumbed. Bada bing, don't it's feed the friends. animals. <laughs> oh, hey. Yes. We want to thank Gabriel Reyes. Uh, and that's pretty much it. That guy. That's not it. Mike Panic. We want to take, thank Mike Panic. We want to thank Gabriel Reyes <laughs> and Michael Panic. What do they do? Who are these guys? Oh, so Gabriel actually engineered and produced the record. Michael Panic mastered it. And he also dealt with our shit through other endeavors before Bada Bing. Oh. San Diego Mexican food. If you're just totally just jonesing for a burrito or a taco, just some Mexican food. Tom, where do you go and what do you get? Can I name two places? Sure, go ahead. All right, so Humberto's. Where's that at? It's in Golden Hill. Oh. And then uh, Super Sergio's in National City off of Sweetwater. What do you get at those two places? At Humberto's, I get the machaca, uh, the machaca plate, and at Super Sergio's, I get their carne asada fries. Oh. What about you, Ryan? Oh, yeah, what? Super Sergio's, I go for the carne asada quesadilla. <laughs> I would actually recommend Colima's to anybody on University Avenue. Okay, what do you get there? The menu is mind-blowing. I get the Bandito burrito. What's in it? Carne asada, beans, guacamole, rice, and there's a chili de in it. Okay. In the burrito. Wow. It's ridiculous. How much do you pay for that sort of thing? $18. No, it's really like six dollars. <laughs> it's it's not that bad. It's not the that salsa bad. bar thing. I'm bummed Santana's isn't around. Don't go on a rant. Come, it was good. Don't go on a rant. That salsa bar. Come on, those chilies? Yeah, no, I know. Oh, deep fried chilies. <laughs> even the carrots are cut like French fries. They're still too delicious. It's not even fair. It's fantastic. How do they do that? MXN. MXN is also MXN. a great place to go for anything. Well, it's still it's Santana's. Is it really? Yeah. It's the same same fucking menu. Excuse me. Same crappy menu. Same crappy menu. One sentence to the world out there that's watching this. There could be somebody in New Zealand or Thailand that's watching this. What's that one sentence that you you want to tell them? I'm sorry and you're welcome. What about you, Ryan? Don't do drugs. You'll look like us.